Hello, hi, I'm Krishni K. Good to and this is Edgar Bok Bok and Bulzak. Now, Edgar is an adventure game that's in development right now at uh, La Poule Noir, which is what the the black chicken. And uh, well, they put out a demo on Edge.io, so let's check out this uh, build together new game. Demo, work in progress. Press F to give feedback at any point in time. All right, I'm going to play with the controller, but as you can see, the game has keyboard and mouse support. Oh, morning. Good morning, beautiful. Bok. What's for breakfast? Bok, bok. Hmm. Okay. Let's see what we got. So this is Edgar. He's, um, he's a little special. As you can see from uh, <laughs> his face and, and headgear. Hmm, a carrot. Nice. Oh, you laid an egg. Magnificent. If Michelangelo had painted an egg, he would have torn this, uh, his art up before such perfection. <laughs> yeah, sometimes, you know, you need to compliment your chicken. Okay, we can go out, we can sleep, you can see the time of day in the upper right, or, oh, let's have a shower, why not? Mm -hmm, a quick shower, obviously, I mean, you know, wake up, shower, then, you know, breakfast, you know? Oh, it will hold out another winter. Okay, I hope it will. Uh, let's see, what do we have in here? Mm, squash soup, my favorite. The trick is to brown the squash in the pan before adding the water. It develops the flavors, you see. And then you need garlic. Lots of garlic. Okay. Well, uh... Let's go outside first. Come on. Ah, lovely. Our garden looks lovely. The wind's gusty and the sky overcast, chick. A storm is brewing. We should get going. To work! Alright, to work. Oh. Can't pick up that. Okay, so we're growing, I guess, pumpkins? Okay. Oh, another uh, carrot. Okay. So we're growing pumpkins, apparently. Let's get all the pumpkins here. Anything else? One more here. Oh, and we can... It's not a good, idea, a good idea to start now. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is the... Okay. A handy carrot. Let's fire this beast up. Put it in the, vapori in the vaporizer. Uh, oh, right. Oh, I just can't put... like. Okay. There we go. That should do the trick. Come on, precious. We need to move. Okay, so that, that carrot over there is gonna attract our... Um... Well, uh, you'll see. Our friend the rabbit. An unborial rabbit yields a power of 3 carat watt hour. Nice! It's like, you know, instead of using, you know, hamsters in wheels, we use rabbits because they're faster. Well, that issue last a day. Now we can work. Okay. Well, now we can start planting. Okay. You see, Precious, the key to a well-built squash is above all a love of the soil. Give me the seeds. Uh, the seeds? Oh, thank you. Alright. After, there's nothing simpler. You drop the seed, you water it, and if your heart tells you so, you can whisper it sweet words. We're not animals. That's true, you know, we actually talk to the plants. Now, Precious, we wait. We wait for time to do its work. For the magic to happen. We watch the horizon with a stern eye. Snout to the wind, breathing deep. We realize that we are, but only human, Precious. Well, you're, you're a chicken, but that's something else, anyway. Because you see, as time goes by, we master our land. We fall into a rut, and finally we forget. In short, we become Ultramucks. Use your melon, chick. Be worthy of the squash. Right. 
Alright, let's continue planting. Oh, what the hell? Crap, weather's turning nasty. Oh, that is crap. Uh, let me plant this last one. And... Oh. oh no! Shh! This is driving me nuts! Bloody hell, not the vaporizer! Come on, precious. We really need to take care of that before they come back. Oh no. This does not look good. I need something to fix this fast. Time's running out. I should be able to patch up the structure with some wood. Oh, okay, we have wood. Let's get some wood from here. Oh, pick wood. Uh, beech or oak? Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna assume that oak is sturdier. Like, like, um, denser, I think. Maybe. So I'm gonna get some oak. Let's try some oak. What? You know what? Thinking about it. The other one would be better. Really? Okay, well... If you say so... Okay. That should work. But the l lightning burned the oil. I still need something to lubricate this wheel. Let's get moving. They'll be back. Okay... Uh... Oh, see? They're already... The squash is already growing. Oh, okay. Let's go... Let's get go get some oil. Back to the house. Back to the house. Oh, Jesus. This is very nasty. Uh, okay. We have some sardine can. Naturally rich in omega-3. Or er, well, that doesn't make it smell any better. But I guess it's still oil. Back off, chick. This stuff uh, stuff will curl your nose hairs. Well, of course, the chick does not have nose hairs. But anyway. Okay. We're gonna use the oil from... The fish from the can. All right. Dope. Let's hope it starts. Okay, we put another carrot there and the tree rabbit. Look at that. What? What? The smoke. Something's wrong. Don't tell me that it's. What? What? What is it? The residium. It's melted. What? They're coming. W what? Precious duck. What the hell? Bugs. Retreat. Oh. We can't beat them like that. What the hell? What the fudge are all these? Uh, bugs everywhere. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Back to the house. Bonk. What do you mean, bark? Without the ionic vaporizer, the lion flies will guzzle all the squashes in no time. Why do you think they're so rare around here? It's a reign of terror, Precious. A huge massacre orchestrated by the drums of violence. Buck, 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 buck. Residium is the key. It's the heart of my machine, a very rare metal. Its essence alone is able to keep the lion flies away. And that's what we need. If we get it fast, uh, the squash will be gone. If we don't get it fast, the squash will be gone. And Precious, a world without squash... That's chaos. Bonk. The elders? What do you mean? Oh. Choose. Almighty Grandmother, lend me your supernatural strength. Oh, Gnarly Grandfather, teach me your legendary allure. Uh, let's go for Grandma's strength? <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, old hag. I call upon your biceps to save the squash from their gruesome fate. Teach me the strength of the earth that I may heal this wretched land. Okay. Is anything... Well, I'd say something about this flop, uh, but I may be a bit harsh. I refuse to be vulgar. Oh. Uh. 
Okay. Oh, look at this! It was hidden behind the frame. Aha, uh -huh, I told you so. The old dragons didn't let us down. Ah, hope. It's not in the blink of an eye, precious. Some kind of phoenix, I guess. What? Appointment. Hairdresser. Tuesday, 6 p.m. Crap, I think the phoenix just pegged out again, uh, my lovely. By my troth, we will not give up. It's definitely a sign. Wait, a sign of what? Of grandmother making an appointment to the hairdresser? Alright, let's go, precious. To Bulzak. Oh, oh, it's daytime. Okay. Okay, so. Oh no, look at all the squash! It's destroyed! Oh no. Looks awful. Okay, come on. We need to go to town and find some help. Is there anything here? No. Come on. Come on, precious. Sail to Bulzak. Yes. <laughs> okay. Sail to garden. Okay. Who's this guy? Wait, is he using dynamite? He's using dynamite. Crazy. Any bites? What does the calendar want? Uh, seriously? For a guy who wears his pants as socks? You've got a nerve. Clearly, sir, is very off. Oh, hmm. Of pay with passion. Between connoisseurs, can I help you with something? Well, is there a hairdresser nearby? Nope. Great. What about some residium? Resi what? Residium. Pal, I've never heard of your thing, but then I've only been sober an hour. Give me time to cool my noodle. Maybe I'll come. Maybe the will will come back to me. In the meantime, you should go ask the village idiots. They'll probably know more than I do. Oh yeah, and if you ever want to bring me a drink, it usually helps. <laughs> okay. Alright, let's leave this crazy guy. Wow, oh, lots of uh, chopped down trees. What do we have here? Do not knock, the cat has the key. What was that? Oh. What? Oh. Damn it. Okay, so the... Okay, so the cat is really fast. Alright, well... Maybe we'll, we'll, we'll get it. Eventually. Ah, the town! Okay. Looks lovely, as you can see. Read flyer. Uh, Whiskat? Oh, instead of like okay, Whiskat. Okay. I'm looking for residium. It's for. Did you know that a freshwater mussel can live up to 150 years? You know, I don't give a crap. I just wanted to. A mussel, 150 years, 150 years rotting in a stream. It's beyond me. Honestly, what the hell could they uh, be? Uh, what could they be up to? Oh, yeah, yeah, uh, amazing. And so, what about my res? There's only old Margaret who could reach such an age. She who's seen everything. She might even know, have known one. Who knows? Okay. Yeah, I'm sure Margaret beats the muscle. Okay, I don't know who you're talking. What you're talking about, dude? Um, hey, I'm looking for a hairdresser. Um, it closed a long time ago, sir. We have to go to Flotron La Pure now. <laughs> ah, that's annoying. Um, I'd like to make a good impression. And where was it before? You know, the hairdresser. A bit further along on the main road. It's a grocer's now. You're scaring me, sir. About time. Okay. Crazy kids. Let's see what we got here. A shop that's closed. Uh, can I now? Town hall. Sorry, sir, but the mayor is not here. Oh. Okay. Uh, 
Or maybe you can talk? Hello, sir. Welcome to Bulzak Town Hall. But I see you don't have our local pendant. I really can't encourage you too much to get yourself one. The town hall offers financial assistance if needed. We sponsoring the product. Um, oh yeah? Some exceptional offers, I suppose. Indeed. We have financing plans over 50 years or more so that everybody has a chance to enjoy the extraordinary benefits of this pendant. And if you can't pay, no problem. We'll tax your closest family members. Everything is anticipated. I only have my chicken. Hmm, that shouldn't be a problem. You should find out more. The shop is outside. Okay. So... So every villager has a pendant? Hmm. Yeah, see? Okay, so they, see they have pendants here. And there's a poster too. Okay. Uh, so everyone has a pendant in this town? What's this? Knock knock. Knock knock? Leave me alone! I told you I don't need to have my spoon sharpened! Uh, what? Knock knock. Get the hell out of here! What the hell? Oh, sock. Okay. Thank you, I guess. For the sock. Hmm, weird. People are weird in this town. Hey buddy, try to breathe. You don't look well. Hmm, might be a case of spontaneous phantom lumination. Weird. This kid is weird. What the hell? Don't look, precious. That's a crime scene. Oh, the egg. <laughs> All right. Fuck. My meal. That that's as sad as an empty fridge. Starting to cook on the ground. Uh, okay. What the heck is happening on the ground? I couldn't help but notice the gigantic bonfire roaring under the village. You're pretty perceptive. Yes, my precious thing so too. Well, as you don't miss a thing, it's said that this fire has burned for 800 years, but no one really knows how it started. You'll suddenly hear a lot of rumors about it. You'll find some information on the history of Buzak at the town hall. Personally, I think the fire's pretty useful. Okay. So wait, there's a fire under the town? Oh, so she wants an egg. Okay, because she... Okay. Um, that's a long pole. What's up with the 8 meter long pole? Well, it's for remote cooking, of course. But I'm working on a telescopic model. <laughs> okay, great. Alright, uh, I do have an egg, so here's an egg for you. I've got an egg if you want. Oh, thank you. That's lucky. My neighbor was saying, the generous fox does not fear the storm. So here's my loyalty card from the grocery store. And it's full. Well, that's nice. Okay. So we got a loyalty card. Oh, maybe that's a card that, you know, the people get with the pendant. So, they have their needs met, I guess. Hello. Okay, weird though. He's sleeping. Hmm. Um, oh. Oh, you don't have a pendant? That's dangerous around here, you know. Uh, I've got my acorn, and Precious doesn't much like that thing. Think about it. You could end up like that guy who fishes all day to make ends meet. He doesn't have a pendant either, and look where he's now. Okay. Oh, the guy that I met like at the beginning. With the okay. Hello. Would you happen to know where I can find some residium by any chance? Never heard of it, but uh, when one is looking for something that nobody knows. We usually ask Margaret. She's the elder of Bulzak. Her house is at the entrance of Bulzak. Yeah, I've been there. I had some issues with her cat, though. The beast is not one to rat. Ha, <laughs> yeah, we call him the white lightning around here. He's fast, 
But he's never caught anything. He's got a rock for a schnoz. Uh, wait, he's got a rock for a schnoz, that one. The nose of a chimney sweep. It's terrible. It's probably connected to what he eats, if you want to know. Oh, yeah? It corks the conk? What? I don't even know what that means. It corks the conk. Mm. Just thinking about it makes me dizzy. An appalling breath. I know someone takes care of him when Margaret's away. And if I knew who that person was, I'd have words with him. Okay. Okay, so we need to get the key from the cat and get into the house and ask Margaret. Oh, go to the organic grocery? Okay. Ooh. Good lord, what a relic. Are you alive? Me, Edgar. You? Yes, it's very mature, that's uh, true. Mm, at this level, lady, that's not maturing. It's embalming. <laughs> yes, embalming cheese. And at uh, Cleopatra caliber. <laughs> Something like that, you know. For instance, I have a client. Her cat loves his cheese fully ripe. Oh. What cat exactly? A cat, huh? So the cat likes the cheese, eh? Can I get anything from here? Hmm. Welcome to our place. What can I do for you? Uh... So, do you know the former hairdresser? Uh, no, not really. We had to live. Uh, he had to live in a hurry, but he was a bit mad, you know, almost paranoid. He said we were being watched, judged, even cursed. Me, I think he couldn't handle the country air. We're not all made for it. Oh, okay, I see. The kind of guy who would wear funny stuff, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I wear funny stuff, so yeah. Well, Edgar. Uh, let's see. Somebody. Oh, somebody gave me this card. Yes. Oh, it's complete. You want a gift? Here it is, a magnificent monster cheese. Wow, help yourself, go on. Oh, this cheese? I got this, the, I got that, that's my gift, some stinky freaking cheese. Alright, so I got a sock and cheese. Thank you, I guess. Okay, I guess I'm gonna explore more. Hi there, listen, at the village entrance there's this cat. Ah, uh, you have seen the white lightning of Buzak. Uh, seen, seen, yeah, that's a big word. It's, uh, mostly I ate dust. The cat's dust. He's so swift that he uh, leaves only a hazy, fleeting impression. A misty trail of white light following in his wake. And I thought my vision was blurred. No, he's well known in the village, you know. Mr. Bond is the only one who's been able to see him up close. Maybe he could uh, tell you more. Without a doubt, you'll find him on one of Bulzak's benches. He likes watching the people passing by. Okay. Thank you. What's going on with the fire, though? What with the smoke and everything? Hmm. Oh. Hey, you don't have a pendant. That sucks, but I really like your space helmet. Does it light up too? Uh, yeah, kid, but only when my brain scalar waves are in phase with a hyperspatial quantic field. Whoa! <laughs> uh, billboards. Whiskat. So this is cat food, right? Oh, and it shows, look, in the lower right, it shows like a cheese and fish. Maybe I can make some cat food? Because I have the cheese. If I could get a fish, maybe I can get, get, make some cat food for for the for that little cat with the key. Alright, let's see what we got here. The bar. Hi there. Fancy a game? Mm, no, no time to fool around. Mm. Wait, pick up a glass. Okay, I got the glass. My respects, madam. 
I would take off my hat to you, but I don't want to lose my marbles. I need the residium. It's a precious metal. Would you happen to be able to help me? Never heard of it. And believe me, when it comes to precious metals, I wear the crown. <laughs> okay. Well. well, nobody knows about residium. Either they're all stupid. Hmm, no. I can't see any other explanation. I could try again with the pyromancer at the lake. I've got nothing to give him to drink, but considering the state of him, that's more help. Uh, that's more a help than a hindrance. Well, I don't know. See, everyone has a pendant. Well, most people here. Hello, I'm looking for residium. Residium? Well, uh, what's that? A rat poison? Uh, it is the salt of the earth, actually. Oh, okay, I see. Type of mole, is it? It's the wind that blows in your hair, the water that trickles from the mountains. No, I'm not an expert on moles, but I get my advice about hair from Margaret. She lives at the entrance of the village. Okay, <laughs> alright. Hello, what can I get you? Um, don't want a drink? Hmm, no, not really. The lion flies are, b are back. Half fly? Half lion, and those odious bugs are uh, bugs are ravaging my land. I need residium. Lion flies, residium. Um, yeah, you've had enough to drink. All my squashes destroyed. The fatal blow, annihilated. Yes, fate, huh? Yeah, yeah. And you know what they say: one lost, ten found. What? Tell me, are you an actor? Because Broadway is not so far. Huh? Ah, yes, yeah, sorry. I wasn't listening. I was thinking of something else. You see, when I shine these glasses, there's a boatload of memories in the reflection. Squashes? No, no, but you see, before, I made twinkles in the customer's eye. I offered happiness in a glass. Squash juice? You're starting to bore me. <laughs> Come on! What can I get you? Uh, a Bolza cup? That's the local drink, I think. Unfortunately, a thirsty crackpot already knocked back my weak stock. Oh, I, I bet it's the guy, you know, with the dynamite. So I have to ration. Uh, Bolza cups are for the regulars only at the moment, but I should have a delivery soon. Alright, can I get a bit of water? Oh, I'm sorry, we're having water supply problems again because of the damn underground fire. Third time this month, so I've only got bottled water. Uh, okay, I'll take it for three squashes. Here, give me your empty glass. Uh, here? Uh, wait, did I give him? Wait. Oh yeah, we got water, okay. Okay. So we got some water... That means maybe we can uh, talk to that guy with. Oh, wait. Does this guy talk to you? Uh, Mr. Bond? I need to talk to you. Huh? Sure thing, but call me John. The white lining of Buzak, does it ring a bell? Ah, young Carlos. Yes, know him well. Sometimes Margaret asks me to feed him when she's away. I really need to talk to Margaret. Do you have any idea how to ch ca how to catch that cat? Perfectly without being an Olympic medalist? Oh, he's not easy. But listen, I might be able to help you. Margaret left me a clear note. I had to leave him a drink of something every day. He has habits of his own. Otherwise, he doesn't sleep well. So I need to give him something to drink. Yes, but na that's not all of it. I love... Uh, I love beasties and all, uh, beasties and all, you know. So I usually add a little personal touch here, uh, something strong that wallops the nose. That's the John Bond special, and he loves it. Okay, what's the John Bond special? But watch out, kiddo. Margaret watches for her cat's education. Carlos is an esthete. What does that mean? If you approach him with a drink, you'd better do it right. 
Okay, which means what? He's a bit of a snob, even for a cat. Uh, it has to be pretty, nicely presented. Otherwise, he won't want it. So, a pretty glass. Yes, you need to show some discernment. Okay, very well. I see we're circling my lexical field here. Still looking for Carlos, right? Don't forget. Find him a drink, and with a dreadful smell. Charm his nose, and you can go near. Okay, so we need to make him a drink. We need to make the cat a drink. Alright, well... Oh, look, she's making the egg! <laughs> she's cooking the freaking egg that we got her. That's kind of creepy. Okay. Let's go all the way back. Talk to the guy. Oh, by the way, the game does have a day-night cycle, so if you want, you could, you know, sleep and go around town at night. If you'd like. Give water. Yes, let's give him water. So, still going strong? I got a few pieces, but not a complete fish, you see? Nothing whole. Well, yeah, because you're blowing them up with freaking dynamite. Of course you're not going to get whole fish. Uh, that's the problem with explosives. It scatters. But I'm pleased with this Sanders head. If you're still thirsty, I've got some water. A chivalrous deed, indeed. I've got a whole Sahara in my throat, and I recognize nobility when I see it. But water? First is a, uh, is a serious matter. People can die from it, you know? Well, yeah, that's why I'm giving you water. Like, what do you want? Like, alcohol? Ah, uh, and, and yet it is the best water that the best whiskey is made of. Hmm, you're kind of nosy, aren't you? What did they say about your residium up there? Nothing. Squat. Zippo. Not an inkling. Yeah, as soon as you stray off the hot topics like boar hunting with, SU with the SUV, there are no takers. Come on, throw that crap away and we'll meet at Nestor's tonight. You'll tell me your story. Oh? Oh! Okay, wait, is it night? It is night! Okay, cool. Uh, what are these guys doing? Playing? Hehe, <laughs> things are going pretty well for me, but I'm worried about the last trick. Bernard could still turn the tables. What about sneaking a look at his cards? Are you in? Uh, but that's cheating! Hey, relax. It's just a little game. It's not serious. I don't know. Oh no, I'm in trouble. The uh, the locks on Jean Pierre's side tonight. Unless, hey pal, you want to sneak a peek at his cards on the sly? But that's cheating. All right, all right. I'm just trying to get my money back. Hmm. He's trying to get his money back. Let's help him. Let's help him. Uh, why not? After all, it would uh, liven up the game. Yeah, if it's, you know, if it's even. Excellent. I'll wait for your signal. Okay, let's <laughs> watch cards. Okay, that's cute. Oh, three aces. Damn, son. Damn. He's got nothing, that's a shoe in Be careful, he's got the nuts. Say nothing. No, he's got the nuts, dude. Be careful, he's got the nuts. Damn, I fold. You helped me avoid the worst. I never know when to stop. Let me buy you a drink as a thank you. Nestor, a glass of bread for my new friend. Okay, but there's no need to yell. Here you go, champ. Your glass is on the counter. Oh, thank you. Wine. Cool. Give wine. Oh, okay, let's give... Uh, I like a easy come, easy go, right? I just got the wine, I'm gonna give the wine already. Okay. Hey, look what I won. Mmm. -hmm. You know, you're gifted. So, that's the notorious the Balzac wine? Yes, that's the local wine. It's not what you'd call light, but on the plus side, you can use it to clean the oven. But... Are there vineyards in Wolzak? Uh, no. In fact, the wine comes from the village next door. Long ago, Bolzak was renowned for its wine, and the uh, Bolzak Cup was famous. Or Bolzaku? I don't know. 
But that's the past now. The people kept the name out of pride. Hmm. So what happened? It's an old story. Some cult caused a lot of damage at the time. But a long time ago. I'm talking Middle Ages, you know? I don't know much more, but there's some info about it in the town hall. Hmm. Maybe we should go investigate. But let's talk business, okay? I'll trade you your glass for an exceptional Xander's head. Almost whole. Deal? Well, yeah. It's my lucky day. I'll just run out of... Uh, I just run out of Xander's head. <laughs> this way, you... Okay. So we got... Okay. Alright. So that's good. We got, uh, we got cheese. We got a stinky fish. And a sock. Well, we need to... Well, get a drink, right? For the cat. Hello, what can I get you? Let's see... Talk about John Bond. Yeah. Hey, I just spoke with this guy on a bench. Mr. Bond. John Bond. Yeah, I know the chap. I need to talk to this woman at the entrance to the village. He suggests I take a drink. Why not? He should get her going. Or, if not, maybe flowers? It's a stylish glass. The guy said I should aim for sophistication. I frest for the eyes. A, a f no, frest. What the fuck am I reading? A feast for the eyes. Something refined, you know? Ah, yes, that makes sense. But I haven't done refined for 35 years, my friend. 35 years? But before... Yeah, it's a long time ago. I have to admit. At the time, I was a fierce defender of the sacred art. The one that defies and surpasses all others. The one that even the myths barely touched on the beauty of. I'm speaking of the art... Of darts? Mm, of the cocktail! The... Clocktail? The cocktail! Good grief! The great alchemy! The grail! In its truest sense! The child of a glass blower, Dionysus and a beach of golden sand! I'm talking about the perfect blend! Uh, supplanting even the nectar of the gods, the purest art. Uh, right. Sometimes I miss it. Listen for you, uh, listen for your, uh, for your skirt. I'll do it for free. In memory of the good old days. But don't tell anyone. People will take the Mickey. What do you want in it? Uh, Nestor Menard, the stir is listening. Oh, okay. Um, I'm sure I've got a still recipe, a real nectar of the gods, like you said. Well, not exactly, because I'm using stinky cheese, stinky everything, so we'll see. Show me! <laughs> Look at this shit! <laughs> uh, it's, it's, it, I mean, whoops, that's, that's what I got, dude! No way, I'm gonna lose my license, that's unbelievable, put that away! What's wrong with your palat uh, palate, man? Or mate? Trust me, I've seen champions, but this almost divine. Uh, and you're gonna kill her with this. Seriously, think about the flowers. No, no, the villagers are explicit. Carlos has unusual tastes. Carlos? Ah, because there are three of you. No, actually, I don't want to know. Well, I'm going to mix the, this Xander's head with your piece of cheese. Then I'm gonna squeeze the sock to get its juice. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Finally, I'll create the cheese crust over the top, put in a little a little umbrella for pizzazz, and it will be superb. Promise me you'll never buy me a drink. Oh, lovely! No text. Oh. Oh, pick up cocktail. Yes! We got the sh stinky cheese cocktail. Stinky cheese and, and sock and fish cocktail and now let's go and see if we can uh, get that key from the cat come on come on precious my precious why is this guy still here oh what the hell is that smell uh, that's the cat's cocktail a classy vintage <laughs> okay I don't think anyone likes that all right all right, all right, little cat. Oh, look! Oh, it loves it! It loves it! 
Enter Margarites. What the hell? Wait, she was whole, home the whole time? Okay. Ah, uh, what a surprise! A visitor! Come in, come in! I see that you managed to catch Carlos. That's quite a feat, young man. It wasn't easy. Yes, this little rascal has rather unique taste. I hope you enjoyed my little game. It keeps you sharp, huh? Look at me, Miss Bilzak, 1868 and still sharp as a knife. Uh, okay, but enough chit chat for the moment anyway. <laughs> what can I do for you, handsome? Uh, I'm looking for something special. Yes. Something rare. Yes. No one in the village seems to grasp the concept. Yes. So people suggested I speak to you. Uh, that you and only you would be able to enlighten me? Yes. So here it is. Do you know what residium is? No. What? A metal? Rare. Cube shaped. Doesn't ring any bells, kid. And I'll be 173 years old next month. Uh, but there must be some way to get my hands on the... What the... Uh... Uh, to be continued. <laughs> so everyone, that was the demo version of Edgar. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, it pretty much ends on a freaking cliffhanger because Margaret here just her eyes just lit up green, which I'm thinking there must be some some sort of connection between that and the freaking pendant that they all have to wear. Maybe some aliens, some, I don't know, maybe that cult that, you know, I heard before. Maybe they have like a secret lair beneath the town. I don't know. Uh, but, you know, for now, that's what we have. Uh, this quite lovely and, 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 you know, reasonably long demo version. Now, if you want to try this demo yourself, you can find it on itch.io. It's available for Windows for free. And as you can see, you know, you can... Um, Give some feedback after you play it. You can also wishlist the game. It's uh, it's listed on Steam. No release date just yet, so we'll have to see when it comes out. Hopefully later this year because it looks lovely. I mean, I, I wish you know the characters were voiced, but you know that that's you know we can do the voices. We can kind of do the voices, so it's fine. Especially especially the precious voice. Like pop pop pop. I can do I can do that. No problem. So uh, everyone, uh, check out Edgar. Uh, Bok Bok in uh, Bulzak, it's a uh, demo version available on itch.io, the game listed on Steam with no release date just yet, but just, just you know, wishlist it so you know, when, so you get notified when it comes out. Thanks so much everyone for watching, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up real quick, and if you like what I do here, consider subscribing, that would be actually immensely, immensely helpful. If you could subscribe, tell other people about the channel, spread the word, check out the back catalog too, because I have over... Ooh, at this point, 2180 videos, so there's tons and tons of cool games, mostly indie games, to discover on there. And last last but not least, if you can, take half a minute to see the ways to which you can support me. You can either give me a direct donation through PayPal, or you can uh, support me with the purchases that you make on the Epic Games Store, the Humble Store, Fanatical. All you have to do in those cases is use, uh, use either an affiliate link or a creator tag. And whenever you do that, you don't pay anything extra. So it literally costs you nothing. You just have to use a link again or or just a text. Um, that's for the Epic Store. You just write cryptic dash hybrid when you when you buy something on there. Uh, also, Brave Browser, download it, try it out. It's a really cool browser based on Chromium, so it, it's going to be very familiar if you use Chrome, if you use Opera. Uh, it has a built-in ad blocker. I've been using it for more than a month now. Well, more than a month and a half, actually. Closing in on two months now. And it pretty much uh, replaced Chrome for me. I think uh, you're going to like it. The people there have some really cool ideas. They're, they're really um, focused on privacy, on not getting tracked. Uh, on, on you not getting tracked, that's what I mean. And, um, you know, and on building a new type of of ad ecosystem in which you are not a freaking click farm you actually get a piece of the money that's made from you clicking ads which is really cool a really cool idea and you don't have to do that you don't have to participate uh, in there but if you do 
you get rewarded. So that's a really cool idea. Check it out, the Brave Browser to the referral link in the description. Thanks again everyone for watching. Check out Edgar on itch.io and on Steam. And that's it for me. Until the next time we see each other, thank you and have an awesome day.